Hello and welcome to Planet Curlacame. On this vlog, that I'm going to be talking about what my, how my trip has been for the last couple of weeks. Um, it's been a while since I've made the last video. And right now I am in the process of packing um, to go back home. And so I will be telling you who, what I've been up to. And, of course, how my school went. So, so far, uh, it's been, this trip has been really good. Um, there have been some mixed things, but I'm not going to get into that at the moment. Um, but overall, my experience at the school has been good. And just in the general trip, um, I've been taking the, the metro, um, into school every day and back so that's good um it's been great and i haven't had any problems taking the bus or anything else and so that's been nice and so to get into class into school uh i've been using this which is new or at least new for this year this is the new sort of tap card you can also put in for atac which atac is the um transit service in in rome it's a private and public uh transportation service and it has buses buses trams and the metro the underground metro um and that's what i've been taking um, to get to school and to get to other places in Rome other than walking because you can walk most places here in Rome but I wouldn't suggest it if you're going from uh, for a longer distance like if you're going to Trastevere from Termini you should just take the metro <laughs> or if you're planning on going to the Colosseo Colosseum in English um, I just use Colosseo because that's how I, what I grew up with, um, in my house. So, I use that term, the name, the Italian name for the Colosseum. Um, if you're going there or for Imperiali, then you want to take the metro, but it's pretty crowded and there's a lot of work currently going on still. I feel like they've been working on the Linea C or sea line in English for like <sighs> since I was in high school um so that's a long time uh working on it probably about at least 10 plus years on that line if even longer um so so let's go Let's, let's talk about my school experience. So this is not my first time going to the school in Italy, here in Rome. Um, it's actually my second. I went like 10 years ago, but I love this school and it's small and quiet and the teachers are really good. The, the, so I like going back. Um, I didn't intend to have a 10 year break between the last time I went and now it's just life happens and other things but um you know we this is I'm in B1 I just completed B1.1 which I'll have up here because it's just a number but it's basically this the the language what you call it um numbering system of, of your wh where you you're at in the in your speaking or your studying it basically b1 is like intermediate or intermediate advanced i don't remember exactly the name but this is you know some of the notes and stuff that i took that's not, not the best page but <laughs> but we basically we were learning a bunch of like imperfect Imperfetto and a bunch of other like little uh, other grammatical things as well as writing, reading, and 
um, uh, putting stuff together, uh, conjugating different types of verbs and using different futures and pasts and some things that English doesn't have, which can be confusing if English is your first language, but it's not like totally problematic, I guess. I know this is like one of the, the worksheets that we work on it's just because sometimes you have to go over like the human body and what terms are, which are important, especially if you want to go to the doctor to know how to describe your, I don't know, your, your ailments or other things. And then my class, I paid for a second part to it. So it was like, I had one more extra lesson. So I stayed out, stayed at longer than some of the classmates and we did extra materials and other things. Probably way too shiny for this. Um, but, you know, we went over songs and did stuff and sang and blah, blah, blah. And, of course, there's homework. Compiti. Important. Compiti. And exercises. Oops, excuse me. That's going to fall off. And we did, you know, exercises and other things, which was really cool. And I'm hoping to go back to this place again. Um, overall, the school, I'm really, I'm really happy. And I really liked my classmates. I really lucked out this year that I got a good, a really good instructor and a really good class. And everyone just like had fun and brought in things, food and other things. And so we got to socialize and talk in Italian and and practice and, and it, it, that's really good because when you're learning hello this is quint from the future editing uh i realized that i went off too much in a tangent and didn't finish my sentence here so what i wanted to say was when you're learning a new language or even your native language it's good to practice uh, speaking and experimenting with words in an active setting without a book or a phone app in hand. And uh, this class let me talk to people that their native language was not English. So it made it easier to um, have to use Italian and also just made it more fun. Um, that was it. So the weather lately, so the weather for the basically remaining of the trip has been nice. I mean, at least today is good. It was supposed to be like really bad weather, I guess, a couple of days ago, but it turned out not to be. But we have had like really a lot of rainy periods, especially in the north and the, in the south, but not so much here in Rome. It's been pretty dry, relatively. I mean, it has rained, um, but uh, it's nice. And, uh, okay, so I had to pause for a bit because I had to download stuff onto here because I just didn't have enough room on my phone. So, now, I think we're done with talking about my school, but um, I'm not sure. But uh, I've had a lot of fun with my classmates and uh, yeah, to wrap it up, uh, that was... A good experience and I will I'm, I'm th hoping to come back soon I just don't know because I have a lot of weird stuff that's happening and so I have to um, figure out what my next plan is and I also have to work some more and do a bit of other things with my small business when I get home um, so so other than that um, I have been exploring other places here in Rome. Um, I went with a friend. I walked from Termini to uh, the Colosseo. That was fun. Yeah. I've done that before. It is a walk. And we didn't mean to. We just ended up going there. And uh, she was visiting from Bolzano up north. I'm sorry. Uh, no, she was visiting from Naples. She's from Bolzano, um, which 
kind of at the opposite ends almost of Italy. One's up here and one down, down here. Um, so she was up here uh, visiting with her mom. So talked to her, had some other friends come over and that live here in Rome, not, not from the US. Um, but now I'm just packing and putting things away and hopefully, you know, I'll be back. The next video you'll see might be a vlog, might not be, don't know. We'll be in the US. Um, so I'll be back. So while I have been here, I have been making a lot of shorts because they're quick and easy, but also they're fun. So I've been going out in, in Rome and doing, uh, taking little videos and other things like these aren't done yet. And, but this one is so like little girl acme out in the world or here. I don't know how well it will show up on this, but it's fine. Finished. This one is. You can see either, but there's like the rough sketches of it. So, like just sketches and other things of uh, about Gerlach and May and Larky Nights because they make it fun. And so I have some shorts on this that are already out, and some shorts that I'm still in the process and going to probably be editing on the plane. Because there's like 13 hours on the plane, so I have plenty of time to edit <laughs> and do some work, I guess. I don't know. Um, but yeah, just looking forward to being home. And uh, it's at the end, you know, two months in a trip, and you're kind of, I mean, sometimes I've gotten homesick this time I haven't really but I am just kind of tired and need to to go back home and and uh relax a bit and then get back into working and and seeing my family and other things so I'm kind of excited for that and um yeah and then I also have some other shorts too that I've made and some vlogs here because so I think that's going to wrap up this vi this vlog video whatever you want to call it um i am going to go start finishing packing because i have a tripod here and i have to put it in because it's the first thing that goes in because it's heavy um so i will see you in the next video um and don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the content that I'm creating uh, here at Planet Girl Akame. It is a little bit all over the place, but that's how I like it. Um, and uh, yeah, push that bell notification for to get more um, notifications of my stuff. You don't have to, but if you want to, you can, because it's just a click. <laughs> and uh, see you in the next video. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Ah, videos, do, do, do. What is running simple videos? Do, 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 do. And that's a nice thing to do. So, goodbye. And get out and, uh, Walk around. <laughs>